the third day of SciFest and it is a scorcher outside, but that has not stopped any of the students and the teachers coming up to Monument for SciFest. Today we're going to take a look around to see what activities are going on and what to be excited about. Let's go. Can I ask you a question? Yes! I am talking to the little boy in front of me with the glasses. The one with the glasses on. Can I ask you a question? His name is PULSE, it stands for Public Understanding of Laser Science and Engineering. He is quite interactive. The Department of Science and Technology asked us, can we build something to teach kids to take math and science? It took us two years to build him, and so far I think he's got more stamps in his passport than what I do. He's been going all around South Africa teaching kids the importance of taking math and science, and he does this little quiz thing where the kids stand in front of him and he will ask them questions, and when they get it right, they get a, a prize, like a mathematical set or something to set them up for that. And obviously if they don't answer correctly, he sprays them with water. With water? <laughs> with water. What is your name? My name is Lauren. What is your name, Lauren, Mr. Oak? It is very nice meeting you. <laughs> it is lovely meeting you too. I am so glad that you have come to see me today at the Science Festival. I really enjoy teaching kids about science and technology. Lauren, can I show you my newest upgrade, please? Please do. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> I hope that you enjoyed your time with me. I'm moving away from her. Yes, thank you so much, Mr. Robot. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Technology Innovation Agency here with Tandra Kazi and she's going to tell me what is going on here. We're basically an agency of the Department of Science and Technology and our mandate is to basically support the state in the exploitation of technology innovations, inventions. For this specific project we are working with uh, Nesman Labe Metropolitan University. It's a conversion of your algae to, to energy, the algae that you find in your rivers. So they take that algae, they grow it and then they use certain chemical processes to convert it to, to, to oil, the oil that you use in your, in your automobile, that is your car. So there we have it, from algae to energy. Tell me, what exactly have you brought to SciFest this year? Yes, the most exciting part of our exhibition this year is the mobile lab demonstrated behind us containing all the scientific and physical equipment that we need for our science pupils grade 10, 11, 12 according to the curriculum. It's endless. They, we can't show them enough. They would like to see many, many, many more demonstrations. Thank you so much and good luck for the rest of SciFest. Thank you so much. Is it all your first time here? Yes. yes. And is it the best time you ever had? Yes. <laughs> okay, and you're going to come back next year? Yes. yes. Very good. So that's just a taste of what SciFest has to offer this year, but come down and check it all out for yourself and there's so much more to get excited about. This is Lauren Flynn reporting for Grow Cut Smile.